Hey guys, Kylie from Offbeat Art here in Brisbane, Queensland. And I was just playing around uh, on some tiles and I thought, oh, maybe I should do another video. So I thought, for a change, because I'm out of white paint, I've got a little bit left um, in my bottle here, but my tin is totaled. So I thought, well, I've got a bucket load of black because I bought a four litre of black when I bought my first four litre of neutral of white, and uh, I've only took out one of these bottles full. So I went out there and shook it up and decided to fill up my bottle again, and I thought, well, black it is since this is all I've got left of me white. So quite a big difference in bottle sizes so yeah I thought right I'll go with some black fur now and see how we go so how's everyone been I hope you're doing all right and keeping the brain occupied and not losing your crew it too much I'm not my kids aren't so that's good I thought I'd go with a bit of a uh, Fluoro Magenta, this is, from Durban. Absolutely beautiful. I know this camera does not do this colour any justice at all. Um, yeah, so... But... Uh, my my base is just a um, semi-gloss house paint. Neutral. Tinted black. That's all it is. Um... You get it from the hardware store. I got mine from Bunnings. I think it cost me about 50, 60 bucks or something. Um, so yeah, and my paint draw mixed with my pouring medium, which is just a mixture of um, house paint neutral, Joe Sonia's gloss varnish, and a bit of polyacrylic. So I know it seems like I'm putting down a lot of paint. But it's uh, a pretty decent sized canvas. The last time I done one on a canvas this size, well, it's not big. It's only a, I think a ten by twelve. But um, the last time I done one on this size, I I did two. And they were decent sizes, so I thought I better put down enough. You can never have too much. Well, you can, but I'm hoping in my case I don't. So yeah. So is anybody doing any painting or anything else, any other crafts, maybe drawing or sculpting or, anyway this is my CA, it is just a titanium white with a bit of floetrol, that's all it is, and uh, my paints are all mixed, um, but depending on the consistency of the paint really, some are 3 to 1, some are two to one, some are one to one. Um, if they're real runny paint, then it's one to one. It just goes on the paint. So here we go. Stop sticking. And I just realized something. I didn't put down a pillow. Oh, I hope this turns out. All right, let it come back into the middle. I don't know you guys. I really don't. Because I put black down. And, uh, funny me, forgot to put the pillow. Too busy yapping, see? Not concentrating on what I was doing. My drum goes sometimes, but you get that on the big jobs. And it's coming in fairly well. 
I'm hoping for a real electric effect. That's what I'm hoping for by only having the one colour. Um, you put two colours, one tends to dominate the other sometimes. Sometimes you can get like a nice even thing, but other times one just really takes over. And I didn't want that. I was hoping for a, a real electrified effect. Alright, we'll see how we go tilting. It's still stuck just a little bit. Just here. You can see how it's not really moving in that spot. seems to be working it's just uh, very very bloody slow going but it is getting there Just heading down to the last side. Well, I suppose by doing it this way, without the extra pillow, it's uh, really stretching it, isn't it? Bring it back to the center. I think I like it there find where my cups are wobbled off to there we go actually worked quite well surprised here I am thinking it was going to be a dud oh it's good to have surprises ain't it there we go everybody knows now if you forget to put your pillow there's no real harm done it does uh, go just very slowly but it does work so that's what I was going for the real I don't know if you can see it the, the white has taken up the pink color and um, it's given a real electrified look so yeah it's quite pretty I think Alrighty guys, well, that's it for me for tonight. 
I hope you guys have a great day or evening or afternoon and uh, don't let things get to you too much and make sure you uh, take precautions when, when and if you have to go out. Take care and hopefully I shall see you next time. Please, if you haven't already, subscribe. I'd greatly appreciate it. Um, and don't forget to hit your notifications bell. That way you'll get notified when I throw another one up. Alrighty, thanks. Bye.